Hello and welcome back everyone, today we will look back at the 1971 American movie Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. We will revisit the cast of the movie and will find out what happened to them. I will also tell you some interesting trivia facts about the show which you probably did not know, so let's jump right into it. Karen Allen is an American actress known for her roles in Raiders of the Lost Ark and Animal House. She's also a director and teacher. Allen has won awards for her work in film and continues to be active in the industry with several projects in the works. Harrison Ford is a legendary American actor known for iconic roles in blockbuster movies. He played Han Solo in Star Wars and Indiana Jones in the hit film franchise. Ford has also appeared in movies like Blade Runner and Air Force One. He is an accomplished pilot and has been involved in several aviation accidents. Despite his private personality, his talent and impact on the film industry cannot be denied. Harrison Ford's career has spanned several decades, leaving an indelible mark on entertainment. In the original script of Indiana Jones, Harrison Ford's character was supposed to use his whip to disarm a swordsman. However, due to food poisoning affecting the crew, Ford suggested shooting the swordsman instead. Steven Spielberg agreed, and the iconic scene was filmed. Pat Roach was an English actor, wrestler, and stuntman known for his memorable roles in films such as the Indiana Jones series and Conan the Destroyer. He appeared in many popular films and was a regular collaborator with director Steven Spielberg. Roach's career was tragically cut short when he passed away in 2004 due to throat cancer. He will be remembered as a true icon of cinema. Denholm Elliott was a British actor known for his versatile performances. He appeared in over 120 films and TV shows, including the Indiana Jones series and A Room with a View. Elliott was a dedicated family man and won several awards for his work. He passed away in 1992 at the age of 70, but his legacy lives on as one of Britain's finest actors. The United States Library of Congress added Raiders of the Lost Ark to the National Film Registry in 1999, recognizing it as culturally, historically, or aesthetically significant. Among all the Indiana Jones films, this is the only one to receive this honor. Paul Freeman is a British actor known for his role as Rene Belloc in Raiders of the Lost Arkansas. He has also acted in films like The Long Good Friday and TV series such as The Bill. Freeman values hard work and preparation in his craft and advocates for social and environmental causes. His talent and dedication have made him a beloved figure in entertainment. Alfred Molina is a versatile British-American actor with a successful career on stage and screen. He made his film debut in Raiders of the Lost Ark and has appeared in numerous other films, including Spider-Man 2. Molina has also had success on television, with roles in popular series such as The Crown. He is known for his ability to portray a wide range of characters and has become a respected figure in the industry. In the iconic Well of Souls scene, a keen eye can spot a small engraving of R2-D2 and C-3PO from Star Wars on a golden pillar. The droids also appear on the wall behind Indiana Jones when he first approaches the Arkansas Keep an eye out for these Easter eggs on your next rewatch of Raiders of the Lost Ark. John Rhys Davis is a Welsh actor best known for his role as Gimli in Lord of the Rings. He has also appeared in Indiana Jones and Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves. Rhys Davis is a talented actor, receiving recognition from the Screen Actors Guild and BAFTA Awards. He is also a philanthropist, supporting causes such as poverty, education, and animal welfare. Rhys Davis has left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry and the world. Ronald Lacey was an English actor, best known for his memorable character roles in films such as Raiders of the Lost Ark and The Adventures of Buckaroo Banzai. Lacey's unique appearance and talent for playing complex characters made him a sought-after actor. He continued to work steadily until his untimely death in 1991 at the age of 55. 
Ronald Lacey was a talented and respected actor whose contributions to the film industry are remembered and celebrated. Harrison Ford's delivery of the famous line spoken to Marion on the ship in Indiana Jones was actually ad-libbed. He came up with it on the spot, making the scene even more memorable. William Hootkins was a versatile British character actor with over 80 film and TV roles to his credit. Best known for his distinctive voice, he appeared in iconic films such as Star Wars and Batman. Hootkins was also an accomplished playwright and director. He passed away in 2005 at age 57. Despite not being a household name, his legacy lives on through his enduring contributions to entertainment. Anthony Higgins is a British actor known for his versatile performances in film and television. He gained recognition in the 70s for his exceptional performances in The Draftsman's Contract and Murder by Decree. Higgins' talent was not limited to the big screen, he also made a significant impact on television. Throughout his career, Higgins has been recognized for his contributions to the entertainment industry. His talent and dedication have earned him numerous awards and nominations. During Brodus' visit to Indy's house to discuss the mission, Jones was dressed in a particular way due to entertaining a young woman in his bedroom. The original script aimed to show her presence and present a more sophisticated persona for Indy. Nonetheless, Spielberg decided to cut the scene, considering that it didn't align with Indy's character. This modification was made to avoid portraying Indy as a playboy. George Harris is a versatile British actor known for his authentic portrayals of complex characters on stage, film, and television. His impressive career includes roles in Harry Potter, The Interpreter, and The Ferryman, among others. Harris' commitment to his craft, humility, and kindness make him a beloved and respected figure in the entertainment industry. Matthew Scafield, born in 1948, was a British actor known for his roles in Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, Gladiator, and Les Miserables. He was also a respected stage actor for the Royal Shakespeare Company and National Theatre. Scafield passed away in 2012, leaving a legacy of captivating performances. Harrison Ford's left leg ligament was torn after an out-of-control airplane ran over his knee. Thankfully, the heat made the rubber tire soft and prevented any bone crushing. Instead of seeking medical attention in Tunisia, Ford chose to wrap his knee in ice and continue on. Wolf Kaler is a German actor known for his work in iconic movies like Raiders of the Lost Ark and Indiana Jones and The Last Crusade. He has also acted in German TV shows and received several awards for his performances. Kaler's versatility and talent have made him a respected figure in the film industry, and his contribution to the field is significant. In addition to acting, Kaler is also a passionate photographer. 